Henrico County is prompting leaders to declare a state of emergency in response to a surge in COVID-19 cases. Now, 8 News reporter Nicole Danzler is live with exactly what this means and how residents are reacting tonight. Nicole. Yeah, Eric and Rico County leaders signing off on a local emergency this week to boost testing resources and PPE as COVID cases rise. A spike in COVID-19 cases caused by the Omicron variant in Henrico County led supervisors to declare a local state of emergency. It allows the county to have a faster pandemic response to possible guideline changes by the CDC and order COVID-related supplies. Alec Auten, Henrico County's fire chief, says their primary focus is purchasing PPE like masks and test kits. You look around, it's two to three times the number of, of infections as we see we saw this time last year. And so we're trying to be out in front of that. The CDC reports in the last week over 200 people were admitted to the hospital with COVID-19. And about 25% of Henrico's ICU beds are filled with hospitalized COVID patients. With county leaders hoping to turn the tide, resident Curtis Milam says he's not so sure. Almost two years and it's been trying on some of us. The cycle's just as you said, going to repeat itself over and over again with the uh, Omicron variant. Chief Alton says the local emergency declaration is just the first step in combating the county surge in cases. The community's mind at ease that we're preparing to be able to continue to be nimble, like continue to adapt to the changing environment. The county says the government and the school district is seeing more absences than normal, but the declaration does not change operations or services. Live in Henrico, Nicole Dantzler, 8 News.